Signata CT5 is really the, the first iteration of our products that we're launching and bringing to the market to fill the interstitial space between the operations and cell manufacturing. The team's been together for a number of years already and uh, working on developing iterations of tools. We have people on staff who have helped work from the regulatory, the quality, the engineering, the scientific standpoint of developing cell and gene therapies. The design approach we used for the Signata CT5 was to bring simplicity of fluid transfer to the labs. We've used proven technology through peristolic pumps and automated fluid control to bring accurate and repeatable operation to our users. The single-use consumables provide flexibility through product formulation or final fill into a various size of uh, output vessels. The user interface will provide step-by-step -step instructions while setting up the protocol that can be retrieved for future use. The user will then pull that protocol up and through just a handful of steps be able to prime the system and start their filling operation. The protocols are available for future use as well as providing the right documentation through protocol reports, batch reports, and audit records to be compliant with GMP requirements. So this first iteration of the Signata CT5 obviously will start with the ability to fill and finish the output consumables of your choosing. But where we really see this going is adding on additional components and additional units that will bring new process steps into the development cycle without needing to buy a new piece of capital equipment. I'm really excited for uh, what, what Signata is it the ability to close that final gap. You have ways to um, do everything in the closed system all the way up to that, that very final step. With the launch of Signata, what I'm hoping to be able to do for our client is having everything closed all the way from cell incubation, cell culture, to the very end where cells are, are being allocated into final container. What we intend to do with this automated system is allow it to retain the flexibility. The automation is in the actual specific step of fluid transfer and movement, but not in how you get it done. For us, the development of tools to support cell and gene therapy really has to be a partnership with our customers. 